Tarthas, new island grew from the old island that is Karakocha. It was named Anak Anak Karakocha or the child of Karakocha. In this picture, students can see when in 1927 they when at the time of the volcanic eruption, all the ash, all the ash and rock carried by the water, but it never carries, it never carries the lava. So with this they carry, they make one more island. See ash or rock say in volcanic eruption, a new island tayarwa. Okay, students. Then the next one is. Okay, then is that the Anak Karkota? It's still this Anak Karkota. It's still active volcano, and the eruption. This eruption began in nineteen ninety four. Also, maybe in eighteen eighty three. In eighteen eighty three, one more is there. In nineteen, is also get happen. Then in nineteen ninety. For also, so students since means in nineteen ninety four is also there are again a volcanic eruption. So with this more lava, what more, more lava flowing out the island? It's still growing bigger because we are uh, that we have discussed when there is a lava flowing, the new the new landform get created because of this a new. Landfall still is going bigger and bigger. So in 1950, the island has grown up average rate of five inches per week. Miss, with the help of this lava student, even you cannot believe it. He was, abhi tak per week. Miss, ah, uh, we they calculate the average five inches. They have increases this island day by per week. Okay. Then the after Karakocha eruption in 1883, surrounding island and coast they covered with the hot ashes. Even in this picture, you can see the whole island that in 1883 volcanic eruption, whole island get erupted, erupted with the hot ash. Okay, then no life remain. No life get remain on this island when, okay, when the scientist, when the scientist they comes, they goes to that island so that they come to know that after, after the volcanic eruption, there were no living things. There were no living things get appeared in the, in the this, on uh, this. Volcanic eruption. Okay, but but what happened? But due due to various reason, then uh, that we knows very well that the climate of the earth was too hot. But then too, but then too, how the living things got uh, started to live on it in the same way that the no living no life remain when a scientist visited in eighteen eighty four. So this, uh, what they found on that island, only one spider. What they found only one spider. But the living, living world on Rakacha was not lost and gone forever. It never lost. Then the we knows very well that with the help of the, with the help of the sea, water, wind. With the help of sea, water, wind, some seeds come with the birds who flew over the island. Plants, animals just live in the sea. Came the coast again. Small animals like ants, termites, even rats and lizard, they travel to this island and plants floating in the sea. Then one edge of the island. Was soon teeming. Means among this means with the hell of because of this, uh, because of this <clears throat> volcanic eruption, all living things get vanished. But later on, with the air, the birds went flying over on the island. The seeds in their legs, in their mouth, so that the uh, plantation get started. Even the termites, ants, 
rats and lizard they also started to move on the leaves then later on students it was like laboratory where scientists can see living things slowly develop in area see students means in 1883 all gate vanished means from 1883 the scientists started to observe that how their living things get developed so today scientists observe that a part of ana karkhocha which does not get covered with a volcanic ash means which which part the kana karkhocha the western coast of java was greatly affected by karakotas eruption very few human beings were left there very few human beings but the wild animals and plants in that area grew in started to grow in number again in fact wild life grew naturally since there were no human being interfere with it there was no other where to cut trees or kill the animals so this region become rich in wild food see because where plants and animals get grow where there are less number of people because we what we do the people we cut the trees we cut the trees we uh, use as a natural disaster we, we use the natural thing so that the living things cannot grow there but wherever less number of people they can develop their the living means wild life can grow together in a large scale so that's why students even you cannot believe where there is a less number of people their wild life can grow